But what are those oxygen tanks attached to? Maybe some of you work with one of these before. It's a handy dandy thumper. Still works well, certainly it does not do compression as fast as we require them nowadays. It runs at about 65 to 70 a minute. We're looking at about 100 a minute now. This is our uh, an old Resistate Annie. As you can see we've got the heart inside, we've got the lungs here. I thought this is kind of neat. Something to put in my uh, 69 or the 67 once we uh, get it on the road. So here we have two, right now there are two uh, D tanks, aluminum. Um, it still weighs a fair amount, so we can just imagine uh, in the past when they had M cylinders that were steel, that this would have weighed a ton. Um, it's fairly fairly straightforward. Both cylinders go into this regulator. So the holes come to the right of the machine, the heart lung resuscitator, that's the right word for it. This knob here will set the amount of thrust in pounds from 50 to 150 pounds of thrust. And this is your on off switch. You pull on it for it to work. And you push on it to stop it. So from inside the machine the air comes out into this hose and hooks on to the top of this cylinder right here. And when we turn the machine on by pulling on the knob, the cylinder goes in and out. The cylinder would go on the sternum of the patient right here with the plunger. These two straps on each side would go over the patient's shoulder and would attach snugly right here on each side and these two straps here on the side would hook on to one of these clips be held snugly in the patient the cylinder would be plugged in and the machine would be turned on to provide CPR as we saw earlier if the oxygen supply hose is hooked on on this side of the machine we only have CPR being provided however if we hook it on on this side of the machine so we have here the gauge that controls artificial respiration calculated in cc's of air per minute and as we can see divided child female and male so when we turn the machine on it does five one five compression for one breath and the air comes out of this hole right here Here it is, folks, your uh, state of the art Brunswick HLR. HLR stands for Heart Lung Resistator. It will be interesting to see your comments online if you use this machine or something similar. As we can see, the HLR Heart Lung Resuscitator came complete with a uh, case to provide compact storage of the equipment. Front view of the case.
here we are. We are now ready to respond to our next cardiac arrest with our state-of-the-art HLR heart-lung resuscitator.